Child Tuesday and the holiday weekend is coming up. Attorney David Ayler is here with more on fireworks, partying, DUIs, and more. Of course, so much fun to be had this weekend, but also right. so much that can go awry, if you will. So where do you want to start? I guess we start with the fireworks. Yeah. That's still usually the fun part, or it should be that the fun part, That is the fun right? part, but I was saying, just from my perspective, well, first of all, let's talk about legality. Can, right. Fireworks, are they allowed? It depends on each city. How does it work? Yeah, you need to check where you live. Obviously, yeah. we all say we live in Charleston, right? Mm -hmm. But we all live in different parts of Charleston, mm -hmm. and what that means is you may live in a different city. Mm -hmm. And certain cities um, allow fireworks, and certain cities don't. Yeah. So what city you live in is going to determine where they're not it's legal to use fireworks mm -hmm. at all. Okay. So what you need to do is just simply check. You probably can go online mm -hmm. and look to determine whether or not the city you're in, no mm -hmm. matter if you're on your own private property or, of mm -hmm. course, on public property, even allows fireworks to be set off. Okay. Now, say they are allowed, and it's midnight, 1 a.m., 2 a.m., and your neighbors are continuously shutting, you know, putting off fireworks, shooting off fireworks, and it's loud, and you have people trying to sleep. I mean, that's right. not that I speak from personal experience. No, not but at all. I'm sure, right? <laughs> Stop shooting off the fireworks. Right. So now you're getting to the point where it'd be a public nuisance. Mm -hmm. And, you know, you're looking at things like public nuisance, disorderly conduct. Mm -hmm. So just because the fact that fireworks may be legal mm -hmm. um, in the city that you're in, if you're setting them off in the middle of the night, mm -hmm. maybe because you've uh, partaken in a couple sure. of adult beverages, uh, that doesn't mean that it's legal at that point. It's okay. no different than having loud music. Mm -hmm. Obviously, it's a, you're allowed to have cookouts and, you know, have music music and mm -hmm. that sort of thing. But again, if it's in the middle of the night mm -hmm. and you're doing it, then again, you're going to have that same problem. Okay. So you, you want to do it within reason. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, I, I, we see that a lot. Mm -hmm. You know, I've, I've been involved in several cases where mm -hmm. you've had neighbor disputes simply because people are setting fireworks off in the middle of the night. They claim, hey, this is my property. It's legal to do Very fireworks. Mm -hmm. But again, those noises, when you have families, people that are trying to sleep, mm -hmm. you're going to have some legal issues there. Okay. You mentioned beverages, obviously right. a lot of checkpoints, et cetera, this weekend, a huge weekend for DUIs. Right. And, and you know, it's unfortunate. Uh, you know that this has to be that way but mm -hmm. a lot of people just don't plan ahead and, mm -hmm. and then the best part that you can do that is just to make sure that you're you know, not in a situation where you have to drive and if mm -hmm. you are going to drive then you need to you know probably not mm -hmm. partake at all mm -hmm. uh, because there's going to be a lot of checkpoints out there mm -hmm. you have a lot of people traveling into the area that are not familiar mm -hmm. with the area so there's going to be a lot more uh, law enforcement out in general mm -hmm. just for traffic enforcement mm -hmm. but of course related to alcohol driving as well after the holiday weekend is it kind of a mess for you when you go into your office sometimes a lot of cases well, there's just a lot of people, you know, you have a lot of people yeah. come in from out of town that mm -hmm. are not familiar with, uh, you know, the roads. And so you mm -hmm. have a lot of just issues with traffic incidents as a whole, accidents, things like that. But you definitely Not do. even DUI. Yeah, just exactly. Trip. Just traffic accidents and things mm -hmm. like that. But you definitely see a lot of people that, um, you know, overindulge and, mm -hmm. you know, incidents happen, unfortunately. But, you know, you can be safe and you can play it smart and you can avoid all that. Yeah, I was going to say best advice for everyone celebrating party this weekend what do we need to do just stay calm and have a good time be smart yeah exactly okay. and don't set up your fireworks at not 2 after 10 a.m please no 10 p.m rather. <laughs> thank you <laughs> have a happy happy holiday weekend happy fourth of yep, july everyone everybody. else stay safe at home this weekend we've got much more low country live in just a moment stick with us